Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and today's video is going to be talking about subscript and superscript. So you've typed out H2O, which stands for water. Grab your shape tool. While it's still a text, you don't have to convert it to curves or anything. And just check the node, which is next to the two, and go up here, right here, it'll even tell you subscript. Press that, and you get the exact, right, correct size and everything. So the same thing on superscript. We're going to check and hold down our shift key and get all the letters that we want to go superscript. And you could do these one at a time. And then you go up here to super and press enter. And now you've got like first place, second, and third place if you were doing a plaque. The good other things you can do with it, while you've got this selected, while you've got that selected, you can change the rotation of it, which I don't know why you would, you can change the distance um, from the letter, you know, bringing it down a little bit. You could, uh, let's put that back to zero. You can change how far it is away from the, the letter by percentages. Anyway, that's pretty cool. It's pretty easy. Um, you know, a lot of things you have to convert to curves to change. But this is in, in what's, some people go, well, I don't see it. Where's it at? Well, you've got to grab the shape tool. You've got to grab the shape tool. Sometimes you have to encompass it. And then these pop up. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. And thank you for watching.